So have you ever lost data from your computer's hard drive? Maybe you accidentally emptied the trash or formatted a disk before backing up your files. It is way too common an occurrence and it can be genuinely a heart stopping experience when it happens. But the good news is that there is a solution. So Wondershare Recover is a free data recovery tool that's available for both Mac and PC. And a big shout out to the team over at Wondershare for reaching out and partnering up for this video. And when you launch Recover It, you'll be greeted with a range of options for file recovery. Firstly, we have deleted files recovery and launching into this will scan your hard drives and disks for any permanently, perhaps accidentally deleted files, allowing you to recover them really quickly. From there, we have the trash recovery option. And this is fairly self-explanatory, but enables you to recover files that have been emptied from your trash. After that is the option for recovering data that's been lost as a result of a formatted disk or drive. And if you find yourself in that situation, then using this option will help you gain some of that data back. Then we have the lost partition recovery option. And this is for those moments where you've lost files as a result of either resizing, hiding, deleting, or really making any change to a partition. Following that is the external devices recovery option. And this is for any data you've lost from a removable device, whether that be a memory card, a USB flash drive, an external hard drive, or really anything that falls into that category. We then have two additional options for recovery, the virus attack data recovery option and the system crash data recovery option. And these will both search for files lost as a result of either a virus or a system crash respectively. Finally, we have the all around data recovery option. And this is for those times where you're not really sure where the files were located at the time of deletion. You just wanna cover all bases. So you can use this option to scan any available hard disk or drive at that time and see whether your files can be restored or not. So here I am at my computer. And one of the things that I'm always doing is transferring video files from my camera's SD card to my computer for editing. And once transferred, I delete the files off the SD card so that I can continue filming. Now, I do this so regularly that it's become quite second nature to me, so much so that I've actually found myself in a situation where I've accidentally deleted a file off the SD card before it was transferred to my computer. So that's where I can use Recover It to quickly restore this file. Looking at my SD card using my computer's file browser, you can see that there are no files on it whatsoever. But if I jump into Wondershare Recover It, click on External Devices Recovery, and then on Next, the software will scan the SD card, and after a pretty short time, will display quite a large amount of files that have been deleted over a period of time. I can then navigate through the files manually or organize them by file type. And once I've found either the actual file itself or perhaps a folder that I think might have stored the file at one time, I can select it and then click on recover. I can then choose where I want that recovered file to be stored on my computer. And then within moments, that deleted file will be fully restored, ready for use again. This is an absolute lifesaver for me. It means I don't have to go out and reshoot all of that deleted footage, which sometimes isn't even an option depending on the project. Think of weddings, for example. The files are here, ready to be edited, so I can breathe a big sigh of relief and get on with my work. You can recover any file sizes under 100 megabytes for free, which is phenomenal. And even if you do need to recover larger file sizes, then the pro and ultimate versions of this software are actually super cheap, especially given how life-saving they can be. So if you're interested in downloading the software or in just finding out more about it, then I will leave a link down in the description below. Aside from that, that is it for this video. Thank you all very much for watching and I will catch you later.